Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I would like to show you a bit more what I'm doing within my company. And actually, I'm going to show you how I built this porch. So we started this project by measuring up the wall to figure out where exactly is the porch gonna stand. And then we drilled the holes into the wall and then we glued anchors into the wall so we could attach the wooden pillars horizontally on the wall. On the front side of the porch we did something different. Uh, we used big ground screws that are maybe one meter long and we drilled them and screwed them into the ground and then on top of them we attached the pillars that were holding the front of the porch. This was a pretty big project, so even the neighbors were coming over to see what is happening. Here you can see that we are attaching a support that will avoid the porch to move sideways. So at this point you can see that my father started to build the stairs and me and other guys went to the shop to pick up the wood for the floor. The owner of the house decided to have a bit bigger gaps in the floor than we would usually do because he would still like to get some light into the windows that are under the porch and that should allow for the light to pass through the floor a bit more. Day two started a bit late because we found out that our car with almost all the tools was wrapped and we needed to go to the shop and buy the tools for the day so we could continue. But in the end that didn't create a big delay for us. So the procedure that we do is pretty much the same as the day before. We are drilling the holes into the wall so we can uh, attach the anchors into the wall. And while the anchors are drying, we started to build other pillars and railing on the porch. Then we started to put up the plates that are going to hold the roof itself. Once that was done, we started to put up the wind support into the top corners of the porch and that also serves as a design feature. By the end of the day, we also put up the roof and the owner of the house decided to have the roof see-through so the light can go into the porch easier. On the third day, we needed to finish the last task of the project, and that is to finish the staircase. We needed to attach the railing onto the stairs, and we also needed to shorten the floorboards that are on the stairs in a way that uh, they would grow as you go from top to bottom. We also added some supports to each of the boards to prevent bending. 